What up everybody and welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for clicking. I'm truly grateful. If you are new here, let me quickly introduce myself. So I make motorcycle vlogging videos and I'm based here in Shanghai, China. And as you can see, I'm not on a motorbike. If you've been following the news, you know that there is a lockdown in Shanghai and things are just gradually starting to open up. And we are allowed out a few hours a few times a day so today's my turn so I'm just taking a walk outside uh, we still can't ride we still can't drive so that's where it's at and as I walk around I just want to show you the view of how the city is picking back up out of lockdown uh, since um, restrictions were relaxed so yeah it's been a it's been two months of lockdown here in shanghai um actually almost three months and it's been hell in some situations so um you should understand why i'm excited to be outside so yeah walking around still kind of quiet for Shanghai but I can see that the city is gradually returning to to normal and this is all what this is what we all want it's a nice sunny day under normal circumstances on a day like this in normal times people will just go to parks have picnics and all that bikers will be on the road whenever they have the time but it just stands out that uh, due to the lockdown this this year's spring has been missed entirely uh, which is something that is unfortunate but yeah it is what it is this is what has happened so i'm out here taking a walk just to get some exercise in my body and also to show you a little bit what the situation is right now so i can see a, bit, a few more delivery guys people actually in my neighborhood we're allowed to ride bicycles and electric bikes from today but i just decided to walk because I want to walk and I hope that as promised from the 1st of June we might start to drive cars and ride motorcycles maybe not all communities but most communities will have the permission to do so yeah so this is how some cars are still packed gates are still locked so this is Shanghai a very unusual sort of picture that you will see on a Friday afternoon it's just gone past 1 p.m. and this is what the situation is here it's not busy at all it's just bicycles and e-bikes so normally it's very very busy around this time but this is what it is right now it is never like this always busy with people but the lockdown has brought the city to its knees and I feel like some people are allowed to drive now because I see a few more cars than I used to but for the most part cars are still packed yesterday I saw a news report that said that due to the lockdown someone incurred up to about a thousand dollars in parking fees at the at the airport he was probably at the airport or he left his car at the airport and traveled and the lockdown happened i don't know exactly what the situation was but he posted his receipt online showing that he had incurred over six thousand rmb in parking charges and that's about a thousand dollars 
So that's just one example of how uh, terrible log lockdowns can affect people. I can tell you for sure that two, two weeks ago, two, three weeks ago, this place was completely silent. And as you can see, auto repair shops are starting to open up. I think they all have permission now to open up. I can hear some hissing in there. So it looks like they are now allowed to to start operations. Schools are still closed anyway. Let me just show you that kindergarten. Still very closed. And I see, oh, I hope that is me soon on my motorcycle. So yeah, things are picking back up and I, I can't hide my excitement. Three months and the lockdown, it's not funny. It is really, really uh, difficult. So a couple of days ago, I posted a video on, on this channel talking about my experience during the lockdown. So if you haven't seen that video, I'll link it up there. You can click and watch it after this video. Uh, and that has more details on what happened during the lockdown. So yeah, today's just a walk around video. As to when workers will be going back to work, I'm not really sure, but I hope it's soon because people are people's businesses are suffering so they need to they need to go back people need to get back in salary and all that some people's salaries have been cut some have lost their salaries completely so i hope things return to normal soon so let's enjoy this walk <laughs> 